On the question of uh, Make in India, which yeah. I can assure you the Prime Minister is going to be talking to you yeah. about at great length. When are you putting factories in here? When are you starting to manufacture? What would be some of the things you'd be thinking about? Uh, we're looking at what we should do there, and uh, we're, we're actively thinking about it. We're working right now in the certified pre-owned area, and uh, that would provide a level of manufacturing because you, you bring those products back to a new level. Uh, and, and honestly, we would look at expanding that uh, as well. Uh, if I could just understand that a bit better. Sure. So are you saying that, uh, that that process will happen in India? That uh, pre-owned phones can be certified? Yes, and we want to do that here. We want to do it here. So the charges that people are going to be making about that program, which is the charge that's come that Apple is just dumping old phones in India, you're saying that's mm. not quite what's happening. You're going to do the refurbishment process here. Yeah, no, no, no. We, we, first of all, we would never dump anything. Yeah. Uh, this in virtually all countries in the world, we, we have a process by which a uh, phone that's been used by the first owner or uh, is taken back and made to be new, if you will, uh, and the warranty is placed on that just like a warranty for a new phone, and it's sold uh, for a, a you know, more affordable price. And that happens in several countries. What we want to do is do the, the act of uh, bringing it back to this uh, pristine level. We want to do that in India for the Indian market. We may have to bring in some phones from other markets in order to uh, to, to fuel the supply chain, if you will. Uh, but, but the act of uh, bringing them to pristine conditions, we want to do that, that in country. Okay, that's, a, that's, that's something big and that's something which I'm not sure is completely uh, understood. understood out oh, here. Interesting. Yeah, so, so I'm that's, glad you pointed that out. Yeah, so if, if that's what you're planning to do. Because the other thing is that also helps you with the price point because you it can does. then start offering not just phones that have been brought back to pristine conditions, uh, to use your words, but also the possibility of having leased iPhones. You do that in other countries, but yes. you can, instead of buying a phone, you lease it for 12, 24 months and then allow it to be passed on. That's right, and that's becoming a more popular way to, uh, to buy a phone because a lot of people say, you know, I, I know I want a phone every other year, and so I'm just going to lease this, and at the end of the lease, I'll turn that one back in and, and get a new one. And, and having an easy process to do that is something that we're working on. We have that in several other countries, but not here yet.